Hello, hello everybody, it's Derek Fries, and today I'm going to be making a video of this 30-inch Home Essentials um, Rainbow Hugger. It's, a, once again, like a knockoff of the Westinghouse Petite. I believe this might actually be made by Bahama, so that might be a possibility, or even SMC. I don't really know. This fan stated of 2000 free. It's a six-blade Rainbow Hugger. And, yeah, this is pretty much as basic as they come. This one's in white, um, which typically these are more common in the rainbow finish than the white finish, which I would have rather had this one be the rainbow finish, but I'm not going to complain. It's better than nothing. Um, so, yeah. Uh, free speed, high to low. And let's uh, turn on the light quickly as has very, very basic plastic pull chains. Always wanted a rainbow uh, fan. Didn't really care what type of rainbow fan it was. I wanted a larger one, like a Hampton Bay Carousel 1, or a corn pinwheel. But this could work. Honestly, not really sure of the OEM, but I really like watching these things run on the low speed. It's a bit fast, but it looks a lot more cooler on camera than it does in real life. So most likely, this fan will probably run all the time. When I first saw a rainbow fan, I thought they were really cool. The first one I saw in person was a Home Trends version that was in the all rainbow finish. Also thought about getting a Hampton Bay Littleton and custom painting that rainbow. Believe it or not, this one actually moves pretty good air. Um, the performance on this is about the same as the Breezeway. I'm surprised that this fan does not hum very bad, but there's little isolators between the blades um, in the motor, there's also little isolators between the motor and the ceiling. And then there's a little uh, rubber band that goes around the globe. So, it, it, it's pretty well isolated. The bearings in this are quiet somehow. This fan was never used. It was sealed in the box when I got it. I'm still very surprised by how quiet this is. On the camera, it looks really cool in high speed. Now I have that, I have that very basic Westinghouse that's out of my garage. My plan this summer is to get that thing repainted and that, I'm gonna paint that one rainbow. I wanna paint it up like a corn pinwheel so like the motor and stuff's yellow. And then that might go up in here. I might honestly make some custom, like, 30-inch blades that are kind of like the corn pinwheel shape. I might cut some out of cardboard. We'll see how that goes. I'm not really sure yet. This thing is surprisingly powerful. These fans are mainly marketed towards children and kids but i can I, I can see in several places where these fans would be kind of cool i'm i'm doing spin down now outside of that possibly in like a man cave or something or um or even like a restaurant like a red robin or something actually i believe there are several there's like some pizza pizza place which i think uh somewhere in california that had corn pinwheels installed in it. There's a video of those going around on YouTube. Amusement parks, probably. At least there was a good amount of fans that came out in Rainbow. Um, Hampton, made, Hampton Bay made a few. They had the Carousel and the Carousel 2. Carousel 2, I believe, is just a, was just a, uh, San Marino, a white San Marino with rainbow blades on it.
bearings on this are somehow really good. The cleanup a bit around on the ceiling around where this is. Also do zero to high because I like how these look. I was very picky on where the colors were on the blades. I wanted to make sure that each side of the blade had the opposed color on it. And it was also in like the rainbow pattern. Because we have purple and yellow, which are the opposite. Red and green, which are the opposite. And blue and orange, which are opposite. And they're all rainbow because uh, red, orange, yellow, green, and purple. So... I think that's it. I forgot I turned it off with the switch. This fan was actually, it was easy to install, it was just a bit lengthy. The motor housing on this kind of looks like a little tin. Reversible too. I don't think, I've actually not tried it out in reverse yet. This fan was new in the box, which I already did say, and it moves good air in reverse, most likely to single pry beyond downdraft low speed. I did it just without hitting my hands on it. It's not best reverse fans will they will they are on, but it looks it looks so cool on the camera. <laughs> Why is this thing so powerful? <laughs> it's such a small fan, and yet the performance is amazing. I feel like some of these smaller fans, they perform better than, like, the 52-inch fans. Um, yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching, and keep the breeze.